Hey y'all, Miss Saint Ellie here, and welcome back to the final leg of Super Mario RPG. I'm not sure if this is going to be the finale or not, because we do have a couple of things to do before we hit the true end of the game, but we'll see. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I have equipped for this next uh, gauntlet. Uh, the only one that I'm kind of like, eh, about is maybe I might consider, you might consider swapping out this feather, but I also do want Mallow to go ahead so that... Uh, so that he can thought peek some of the things that are coming up. But yes, this is what our our setup is like. Uh, most everyone is level 23 except poor Peach. But Peach is just on healing duty anyway. She's here to keep everyone alive. <laughs> but with that, we're moving on to the next room after filling our pockets with Toad's merchandise. Here's the report. Sir, drill bit will be finished on time. We're ahead of schedule. We'll make Smithy proud. Good work, everyone. The harder we work, the stronger Smithy will become. The weapons we manufacture here will be... Just think of it. When Smithy takes over Mario's world, we can do anything we want. Hey, I didn't realize that... <laughs> that this entire world is Mario's world. Imagine that! Imagine just, like, overhearing that and just being like, Wow, you're singling me out? Okay. Ha ha ha! Not so fast! You sure are a cocky bunch! I rule this world! Don't you forget it! Oh yeah, and Bowser's literally right there being like, But what about me though? <laughs> it's Mario! The <laughs> Claymore and its spirit of its clothes didn't stop him! Oh, poor Bowser! No, no! Leave Mario out of this! I'm the one you need to worry about, not him! Mario, you're about to make the longest jump of your life to hell. <laughs> you're ignoring me. Oh, Bowser. It's all right, Bowser. We'll, we'll, we'll make sure that he knows better shortly. But first, we're going to thought peek this pounder. I don't think we have this thought peeked. I think this one is unique to this fight. Uh, but yes, here he is. Wham, bam, slam. Uh, I'm gonna let Bowser just punch him upside the face. There we go. Oh, that was a weird animation, but okay. Uh, I'm afraid of him dying before I can thought peek him, so I'm gonna hit something else. And now I'm gonna thought peek the manager! Honestly, he looks even more like Shovel Knight than the last guy. 25 years of employment! Ugh. Uh, okay. Yeah, just keep- just keep bopping him. He should go down pretty quickly. Uh, Spritz Bomb? Oh, I don't know what that timing is. Oh, god. Oh, that's fun. Well, he's dead. He's dead, it's fine. We'll just Thunderbolt these two and get them out of the way. Look at that. I think we'll get, we'll get healed because that was a boss battle. Hey, look who joined the 23 club. Happy birthday, Princess Peach. Uh, okay. Magic, magic. Yes, absolutely. Um, well. Like the moon over the day, my genius and brawn are lost on these fools. Haiku. Bowser, I love you. I love Bowser. Oh, and the pet pat. Um, well, that's it? That's it? He's just like, um, yeah, well, I'm just kind of bummed, that's all. Amazing, incredible. And yeah, we are fully healed, that's good. I do like how we get to see how these, uh, machines are, are, um, are painted. I think that's pretty neat. It looks almost like a freaking, uh, airport checkpoint, but, you know, shrug. <laughs> And we do have one more person. You there. Are you the one in charge here? Do you know what your weapons have been doing to our world? Stop this nonsense at once. I'm afraid that is impossible. Any dissent against Smithy will be dealt with by immediate shut, uh, meltdown. Um, meltdown? <laughs> you can't scare me. I've got Mario by my side. 
Dissenters will be eliminated. Production will continue. Wow, Peach isn't even a part of this fight. Peach just uh, really ran behind Mario. Is like, hey, you deal with it. Uh, there we go. And once again, we're gonna thought peek this pound it. Oh, uh, wait to lightning as per usual. Love conquers all. That's weirdly wholesome for one of the final enemies in the game. Uh, okay. Bop him. Bop him, Bowser. Honestly, these guys don't do a whole ton of damage except to Mallow. Mallow's like the one that's like actually taking a significant amount. So, uh, sucks to be you, Mallow. Sorry about your, your fear at current moment. Uh, but we're gonna Thought Peak Director. Uh, what you got? The union, my son's exams, career changes. I've seen a lot during my time. Oh. Oh, this dude's got straight up a family somewhere. Oops, that's gonna hurt a lot. Yep, that, that definitely hurt quite a bit. It's okay. We'll just keep on going. I think Mallow should be able to take him out with, uh... Ow. With one Thunderbolt, I'm wanting to say. So we'll just keep focusing down the director. Never mind, he's down. Uh, go ahead and Thunderbolt everyone, Mallow. Yeah, everyone in one go. <laughs> Lightning defeats everyone. What are you talking about? This savvy love defeats all stuff. <laughs> that was scary. But we can't run away now. We've got to kick these low lives out of our world. Yeah, that's right, Peach. You tell them. So, uh, even further up the production line, these guys are getting pounded into shape. But now. It's time for the final rumble. Let's save. All right. Moving on to the next area. We have this, Mario. I'm surprised to see you here. But this is the end of the line for you. This is the closest you'll ever get to Smithy, so savor the moment. Or else you'll be fodder for my incredible invention, the gun yoke. That's so intimidating sounding. <laughs> The gun yolk. Yeah, we have the factory chief and his giant uh, tank of a weapon. This is the last, like, uh, precursor to the final area. So this one's probably going to hit a little bit harder than the other three that we just fought. Uh, thought PQ, we have... Oh, you have a significant amount of health, don't you? If we're beaten, then no, there will be no one to watch the boss's back. Yeah, that's kind of the point, isn't it? And that's literally what I just said, too. Uh, ow. You know, we're just gonna... Bop him, bop him, bop him. Uh, okay, no damage. Thought Peak, the factory chief! Let's see, you're weak to fear and poison. This month's goal is 1,000 Shymore units. How many, how many would that be per day? Assuming 31 days in a month. I'm not about to math that out. You guys can do that for me because I can't, I can't be arsed. <laughs> I cannot be bothered. But that sounds like a lot of units. Uh, breaker beam. Oh God, wait a second. Uh oh. Hey, that hurts a lot. Bowser is struggling. Hey, speaking of Bowser is struggling, um... Yeah, you know what? I'll just keep you out for a Thunderbolt. Uh, and I'll swap you out for Peach, because we can use a good old group hug. Yeah, the this gun yolk does actually hurt quite a bit, so that's the reason why I'm focusing it out it down first, because that beam is nothing to sneeze at. And if you're caught with low health, then uh, good freaking luck. Uh, thankfully, we have had experience with a similar beam in the Axum Rangers, so it's not too much to worry about. Uh, I'm just gonna, you know what? I'm gonna star rain you. This affects everyone, but I'm about to heal anyway. Yeah, 
all of that damage. <gasps> I wonder if I can't, oh wait, make me mad and boom. Wait, have I ever used this? I don't think I've ever used this. Hit A repeatedly for more damage. Oh yeah, button mash, I'm good at that. Oh, so Peach just straight up has like a billion bombs on her person at any given time. That's kind of insane. That's wild. I support it. But there he goes. He goes down. It's not uh, too hard of a fight. Ah, Hmm. The production line hasn't halted. Look, Mario. This is where the weapons come from. Yep. Right up there. <laughs> right down those pipes. Those metallic pipes. This must be where Smithy makes his weapons. To find the last star piece and stop the factory, we've got to defeat him first. Mario, there's no turning back now. Are you ready? That's your warning. This is the point of no return. Our quest is almost over and when the time comes, dot, dot, dot. Come on, let's get the show on the road. That is your warning. As soon as you press this button here, there is no turning back. So if you have things that you want to do, if you haven't fought Culix yet, if you haven't done uh, some side quests yet, or there are things that you want to do, or even if you just want to grind up a bit more, uh, right now would be the time to turn back and go home. <laughs> but, uh, we fought those three pretty quickly, so I think this officially is the finale of Super Mario RPG. That's wild. Man, it always feels weird to, uh, wrap up a series, but here we are. Anyway, we just gotta wait a minute because this thing needs to put down a bolt and then go ahead and pick us up. It picked us up by our head! Hey, I think I hate that. I think I think I pretty much hate that thought. At least it was only like five seconds. Welcome to our final challenge. Mr. Smithy himself. Hey! There's the last star piece! Right on his bosom, huh? Are you finished your tour of the factory, huh? All right then, how about a little demonstration? Yo, Smithy, stop making those things and hand over the star piece now. Yeah, yeah! Huh? <laughs> Guffaw, ha, ha. So you're Mario. Looks like we're gonna have a, a little dispute over the star. Just hand it over and get out of my castle. My, my, we're a little touchy today, aren't we? You know, I'm actually growing rather fond of this place. Please, don't make us go through any more. Just give us a star now. Oh, better yet, why don't you give me your stars? Why, then I could easily conquer this world. Then we could get rid of all wishes and create a world filled with weapons. <laughs> well, that sounds like that rightly sucks. <laughs> Over here now, I'll crush you all! Yep, an intense intro by none other than Smithy. We have Smithy and the Smelter. Oh, uh, we can hit the Smelter and make it take damage. It kind of looks like a fish. Uh, let's see, a uh, Thought Peak for the Smelter. Weak to lightning! I'm spitting hot fire! Good for you, my dude! Uh, you know, right off the bat, I'm gonna go ahead and just... Nope, not that. We're gonna hit him with a triple move because uh, we're going to be building up energy all of the time throughout this whole fight. So we might as well make use of our, our special attack. See what happens. So that smelter should be out. Oh my god. Should be pretty weak by now. Uh, and now one more thought peek for Smithy himself. No weaknesses, a butt ton of HP. <laughs> hey, not bad. <laughs> wow, he respects us, kind of. Uh, I do believe the smelter is now down. Yep, it sure is. <laughs> the eyes are closed and therefore he is dead. Now, we just have to focus down Smithy. 
more gauge up. We're already back up to 25. Uh, he has no weaknesses. Mm, so, you know what? Yeah, let's swap over to Peach just so that Peach can do a quick little bit of therapy on Bowser. Excellent. I honestly, I love the thought of Smithy's design. He really does look uh, like a part of this weapon world. But also, oh god, that's so intense. But also, like, I don't know. There's something about his design. He reminds me very much of, like, uh, ye old fantasy dwarves. But also very metallic and weaponized. And I don't know. I really do love his design. And uh, like I said earlier, this music, freaking intense. Very spooky. Very, uh, very much feels like this is what we've been building up to this whole time. Uh, just a few more bops should do it. I missed the timing. Another sledge. Can't block it, but everyone's doing okay. I guess I could take Gino out, uh, but I feel as though he's probably going to go down shortly. Yeah! No! Oh, uh, now we have a temper tantrum. Come down, Smithy! Your head looks like a geyser! Don't get so worked up! Think of your blood pressure! We just built this yesterday and the foundation's very weak! So stop shaking the floor! Imagine yelling at your boss like that, who has a giant hammer. Oh, what the how in the heck? Yo, dude, they warned you. They literally warned you. They told you, man. Why are you surprised? And welcome to hell. <laughs> no! Whoa! Oh, whoa! I'm burning, burning, seething. Never have I been so wronged. It is time. I will show you my real form. I will show you my true power. I will teach you respect and I shall have my revenge. <laughs> Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Power up. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Whoa! There he is! Come on, you puny ants! This is Smithy, the true form. And man, I have to say, between this music and the background and Smithy's kind of really creepy design, this specific fight really stuck with me over the years. It absolutely just hit me like, oh God, this is uh, extremely creepy. This is extremely cre creepy. And I don't know, I, I, one of the things that really sticks out to me is that, that face in the back and just the eyeballs jutting out. This one over here has its eyeball rolling out onto the floor and all of them are failed versions of Smithy himself. Look at them all. It's freaking wild. And we can also see like uh, a little face of Bogier in the back too. <laughs> Bogier's just hanging out. Um, but I, I find this really cool and really intense, honestly. Um, there are two pieces of Smithy, the body and the head, which will come into play very shortly, but I do want to go ahead and thought peek this head. No weaknesses, but <laughs> 8,000 HP. We're going to be here for a minute. Hmm, you're not bad. That could be a problem. So he can pound on his head and change its form. This is tank form. Uh, all of the forms actually do share a, uh, a health bar. So you don't have to worry about like, you know, uh, you don't have to worry about which one you're going to be attacking. Cause like, as you can see the, the attack that Mario did, uh, did take it down uh weak to lightning precision machines like me have to be careful around electricity so each form will have a different weakness 
and we'll have a different thought peak. So we have to keep on thought peeking throughout this entire process, which is kind of wild. Uh, wow, you are the final boss and you did a single HP of damage. That's kind of, it's kind of sad, my dude. Never mind, that was very hard. Uh, I really don't want uh, Mallow to take damage. <laughs> You know what? Yeah, let's let's get you out and let's just uh let's do a comeback on Mallow. Oops, I missed the timing. So that's ha half health. Okay, you're gonna swap back over to your standard. Never mind, you're gonna swap over to what is that? Oh, it's like a mage. Oh god, that's really creepy. That's, a, that's extremely creepy. Oh, well, we're just gonna keep on pounding away. And now, Thought Peak, this one! Still haven't gotten to Thought Peak the body yet. Magic is my strength, but defense is my weakness. So, while this one is out, you might be... It might be prudent to just... Oh, God! Mallow, once again. Um... Hey, Peach, I know Mallow's down, but I think we can use a group hug for our two that are still up. There we go, and you can do a pick-me-up for Mallow. We're just gonna do it this way. Thanks, you're welcome. Got a freebie. Excellent. I'm not using any of my items. Okay, so we're gonna thought peek the actual body this time. Uh, no weaknesses on the body. My head's so heavy. Can't block this. It's probably gonna hurt like ho oh, oh. Also, he does attack like twice in a row. Uh, one more group hug. Let's tap everyone off. Bop, bop, bop. Uh, and now you know what? We have actually thought peaked both of you. So let's do a thunderbolt. Ah, oh, resistance, I see. Another one. Okay. Swap back to that. Are you gonna swap to something else now? Sure are. <gasps> Casket form! That's creepy as heck. I don't know, there's something about him having a literal casket as a face that does not sit well with me. I hate that. I hate that a lot. Uh... Let's see what the casket thinks. Oh, uh, weak to ice! Still 6,000 HP left. Time to heal while nothing can hurt me. That sucks for me. Alright. Uh, everyone's fully healed, so I think we'll be good to pull out... You know what? Gino. Gino hasn't really done enough yet. So let's... You know what? A Geno boost on Mario would be good. Yeah! Attack and defense up, so... That should help. <laughs> okay! Okay, I do my buffs and you immediately shredder it away. That's fine, I guess. Uh, let's Let's bop your body. Yeah, 400. Uh, you're weak to snow, so I'm gonna go ahead and use a snowy. Yeah! Whoa, can't, can't move! Smithy's body can't attack, so that's what happens if it runs out of, uh, runs out of HP. So that little, like, gun thing is currently disabled, which is awesome. But he can still morph. Which I'm kind of okay with him being off of the casket mode. We are back on tank mode, baby! Oh, resist? Nice. This one is weak to electricity, so Mallow stays out. Oh, God. Uh, Mallow, do a shocker. Uh, I think, yeah, we're gonna swap over to you and heal Mario because Mario's like a hit or two away from dying. 
Oh, we do have another special attack that we can utilize. Ow. Uh... You're sw should I swap in with anyone? Uh, no. You know what? I'm gonna do another shocker. Yeah! Big ol' weakness. Now, uh, I could therapy... What's the triple move here? Healing Rainbow can even revive... No, I don't... I'm not that desperate. Uh, you know what? It's been a minute! Let's do it! Star Riders on Smithy! This game's classic trio hits again! Bam! 500 damage? Not bad. Uh... I can just bop you. <laughs> I'm burning with power! Smithy's body can attack again, so yeah, it is not permanent. Uh, it just lets you catch your breath, so to speak. Uh, we could do... Mm, no, I'm gonna... I'm gonna pull out Peach and do a little group hug. Okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Uh, another boost. And a slap. There we go. Okay, we're doing good on deflecting, too. Uh, everyone's fully healed, so... You know what, Mallow? Yeah, do a Thunderbolt, because we can attack multiple targets now. And this one is weak to electricity. He, that also hurts a lot. Okay, bop, bop, bop. Oh, goodness. Ouch. Uh, should I bow out? No, I'm gonna Thunderbolt again. Okay, you're swapping out, but who are you swapping out with? You're swapping out with... Ah, the mage! Actually, pretty convenient. Because... Oh, Bowser is also hurting. Uh, because this one is weak to physical attacks, and that means we're gonna do a butt-ton of damage all at once. Uh, you can swap out for Peach for now. And we're gonna therapy Gino. Uh, another? Yeah! That's a pretty attack! I know it's like, you know, hurting- Ow! Ow! Uh, yeah, that's hurting a lot. But it was a very pretty attack. Uh-oh. Excellent. Okay. Hmm. I, you know what? I can swap them out. And this way, when it comes down to Peach's turn, we can group hug and everyone's going to be back up to full. Gino in the background is just uh, hurting a little bit unconscious. You know how it is. Okay. That... I. That timing is really strange to me. My body and head are burning. It's not possible. I don't believe it. No, I finished. Done for. You, you meddlers. <gasps> no! And everyone died. The end. Except not really. Of course not. Only Smithy has perished this day. And he's left behind a little gift. Come on, Mario. Send the last one way up high.
We've got it. The final star piece. For a total of seven. Thank you, everyone. The star road is back to normal, and... It's so sweet! I love it! Oh, they did that cutscene so well in this remake. Oh, my little heart. Oh, and now we get to see everyone. How they're all turning out. Aww. Oh, that's wonderful. That's so good. Granted, I do I do have to think um think about like I kind of wonder what it's like just having the empty doll after all of that just like is is that is that his body question mark I mean it never was truly Gino to begin with Gino was always a part of the stars but I I, I would imagine that would <gasps> they got married oh I forgot about that. <laughs> The booster doesn't know what to do! Amazing. Dodo, you deserve better, dude. <laughs> oh, I love this sort of epilogue, too. Just seeing all of the places that we've been through and, and all the people that we've met throughout the game and seeing where they end up and how, they, how they're handling themselves after everything. Of course, Johnny's just being cool. <gasps> there he is, the prince! Aw, oh, bless. He went back home. I hope he keeps the frog sage close at heart, though. <laughs> Bowser repairing his castle. I love this. Get back to work! Oh, that's so cool. Everybody's here! Let's go! Thank you so much for playing my game! <laughs>
Oh, that was so good. Goodness. So I wasn't I I wasn't sure what I I was I was very very excited about this remake because I've always loved uh Super Mario RPG ever since I played it for the first time on this channel all those years ago. Holy crap, it's been an age. But I was really hoping that they'd do this remake justice and Honestly, I feel like they did. It was so good, and 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 the little things that they did change along the way kind of modernized it a little bit. I feel it, there was nothing that was changed that I kind of squinted at, uh, like I've done for some previous <laughs> some previous remakes. Cough, cough. Looking at you, Majora's Mask. Cough, cough. But. Whenever, whenever an old game like this gets remade and there's announced that it's gonna have some changes along the way, I'm always a little bit skeptical and a little bit worried, uh, but I feel like they did it very, very gracefully in this specific case. All of the, all of the, like, modeling and all of the rendering of all of the areas and the characters were done super respectfully and very, very, uh, and very true to the original roots while still giving it a nice, fresh, updated look that is, uh, that is more, you know, modernized, more like the RPGs that we see today. And they even gave us some new, some new ways to play the game with the, with the small adjustments to like the timed attacks, to the special attacks, and, you know, just giving us a fresh way to, to, uh, interact with with fights and and characters that we have haven't seen in so long i really wasn't sure if they were even going to make a remake of super mario bg i always hope for it i mean we all hope for it but i wasn't sure specifically because you know it's a collaborative effort between nintendo and square enix so it was like a a big old question mark but i always had hope and honestly, this gave me what I was what I was wanting and so much more. Um, especially with some quality of life adjustments, like the signal ring being available earlier on in the game. Just some little adjustments like that that make a lot of sense to to make. And I I, I really love it. Um, I especially really like how they updated all of the music. The mu <laughs> hey, look at that! The music! I chose a really good time to start talking about it. Um, the music update was spot on. I, like, they were all familiar and they were all done in such a way that I remembered all of these songs and they all sound like they, like I remember them, but they were new, they were fresh. It matched the new visuals and it matched the new atmosphere that we had with this, uh, with this remake. Uh, and I do believe now that we have finished the game, we do have the option to swap back and forth on the old version of the music and the new version on the fly. I do, I do believe, uh, which is pretty neat. Uh, oh, cool. And they swapped to the, the, the new graphics part way through. That's cool. Look at Johnny, look at Johnny go. But yeah, this was, this was an absolute delight. An absolute delight to play. An absolute nostalgic, uh, just a nostalgic look into what this game was and what it has become. And I'm so glad that I got to play it pretty early on and share my experience uh, with you guys. This, the, this is probably my favorite way to experience games now is just having the experience recorded and being able to share in it with a community that is so supportive and so nice and so and so knowledgeable there are so many of you who are so knowledgeable about these games too that uh is just stunning to me and it's it's interesting for me especially now that i'm done with everything and i don't <laughs> I, I don't have to worry about being spoiled on like uh, functions and different features and stuff like that. I can go back and and read some of the older comments that I might have missed over these past few months. Um, but it's it's wonderful. This was a great experience, and I'm excited to uh, tackle new games moving forward. 
But even though we are done with the main story of Super Mario RPG, there is a post game that has been added and we are definitely going to be taking a look at all of that. So please sit tight. We're not quite done yet. We're not ready to leave behind Super Mario RPG just yet. <laughs> and definitely not my love Bowser. <laughs> but that'll come in the form of new episodes. So just like I said, sit tight. We're not quite finished. And we have a little bit more to explore in this gem of a remake. I'll see you all very soon for more Super Mario RPG. Thank you for watching.